Good. So this is the lab on a force table. And the first setup says that I have 350 grams at zero degrees. And there is a hanger mass of 50 grams at another 300, so 350 grams, which is 3.5 newtons. Then I have 300 grams at 155 um, degrees. And then I have 150 grams at 240 degrees. And as we can see, the whole thing is balanced. The next setup says that I have 250 grams at 350 degrees, so I'm going to move this over a little bit. By moving over, you can already see that it becomes unbalanced because now I'm in the wrong spot, so I took 100 grams off to make it 250 grams. Um, 87 degrees is going to be over here, and I'm supposed to have 520 grams. Here. And the third one is 550 grams at 240. So I put 400 grams on there and that angle stayed the same. And again, we can see that the entire thing is balanced. Okay, we're going to move on to part C, which says that it is accelerated. And it says I have 200 grams at 350 degrees. So yeah, 200 grams at 350 degrees. Um, then I have 250 grams at 87 degrees. In fact, I do. And I have 250 grams at 240 degrees, and I do. And when I release the ring here, we can see that that one is being pulled off the middle. So the whole thing is unbalanced and I have a net force pulling it apparently in that direction and here is the counter force for which I have to figure out what is the ideal angle and what is the amount of force with which to pull it and I want to say that it's about the angle that I have here and that's as far as I measure here exactly 180 degrees and I'm measuring 0.8 newtons And the fourth and last setup, I have to figure out what the force is in order to balance the whole thing. So I got, so far, 250 grams at 140 degrees and 450 grams at 240 degrees. So there it is. And then, of course, the ring here would be pulled off quite a bit so again I have to find the angle and the amount of force in order to get it balanced here and I come up for the angle this is a measurement of course 25 degrees and it is not around the 25 it's not 24 26 it's 25 degrees is what I'm reading and I come up with 4.8 newtons and that is the lap on the force table.